All right, how do we make equal groups? Well, multiplication is just groups that are repeated. So for example, we have two times four. That means I'm going to make two groups and I will put four items inside each group. Or I can make four groups and put two in each. I'm going to show you how you do that here on this project. So first I'll grab a group. I can use this one or this one, doesn't really matter. But before you grab it, make sure that your cursor um, is this shape. So it looks like a plus sign with arrows on the end. That is the shape that means grab. If it looks like this, the arrow, that's not going to work. So you wanna make sure it changes to that. Click down and then grab it. You can see that it's selected because it is outlined in blue. All right, there's one group. I need two groups. There we go, there are my two groups. All right, you can make them bigger if you want to, but you shouldn't have to with a problem this small. Okay, but just so you know, to make it bigger, you click, drag over to the corner until it turns into this, click down and pull out and you can make it bigger. Okay, I'm going to undo that by clicking the undo button. Okay, so groups of four. We have two groups and then I need to put four inside of each one. So I need to put four in here and then another four in here. And you can choose anything you want. I'm gonna work with the zebras. So I'm gonna grab a zebra. I need four zebras. So there's one, two, three, four. Okay, that's one group of four. I need two groups of four. So I'll keep going. One, two, three, four. And there we go. And then to find the answer of two times four, you just count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Therefore, two times four is eight.